Hello, beautiful soul. Welcome to your weekly astrology. Actually, it's quite a quiet, pleasant week, more or less, if you play your cards right. <laughs> anyway, we've got Sun trying Jupiter, Mercury opposing Mars, which is the slight fly in the ointment, and um, Sun trying Neptune. It's interesting. Here's your weekly astrology. Gemini, there's a lot going on this week and it's actually hugely important for you more than most other signs because Mercury, your ruler, is joining forces with the North Node uh, in your position of communication. Very important news. News for your future, news that can heal the past, news that can give you confidence in your ideas and putting your ideas out there. So, you know, definitely connect with people, talk to people, listen to people around that time. And you should be amazed by some very relevant piece of information. On the 5th, it's quite a day with all sorts going on. Chiron's going stationary, makes life a little bit easier for you in groups of people. The sun is trine Jupiter. Very positive aspect. One of the most positive aspects. It creates real optimism, joy. Uh, the opportunity to grow and expand and you're thinking of growing and expanding um, your practical ability to make to draw to you abundance so all things to do with work all things to do with making money and your sense of security in the world that's not something gemini's necessarily focus on all the time you know you are an ideas generator but this lovely little aspect allows you to come up with a genius idea to be practical and to feather your nest, as they used to say back in the day, to make it all, you know, safe for you in the world. And you're able to go, right, all my genius, I'm going to plonk down and ground. You know, I'm very close to a lot of Geminis. One in particular you may know, artistic genius, maybe making this film. And uh, she doesn't mind me saying, hopefully she'll skip through this when she's editing. And genius, but sometimes doesn't put that genius into action. Because Geminis just focus on the bigger picture all the time. So this is your chance this week to ground your genius and make things happen. To plant your seeds. Anyway, the only uh, bum note of this week is where Mercury opposes Mars. Annoying. It may be that there's somebody trying to push you. Or you may feel there's just some argument with someone or some friction. I wouldn't focus on that. Or maybe someone's pushing you to expand too quickly and you want to take your time. Just, you know do things your way but sidestep the argument because there's so much more important information this week so it'd be foolish to put your energy into conflict you need to put it into you know making life fabulous for you finally on the 8th the sun is trying neptune a delicious little uh, transit because it allows us to really feel intuitively our way and have confidence in our intuition and again for you it's about money and career so really the flavor of this week is for you to trust your ability to succeed take care gorgeous and i'll speak to you soon Hello, wonderful one. Thank you so much for listening. It would be fabulous if you liked, subscribed or shared. It would be really, really helpful. Also, I have a ton of free stuff for you. 
horoscope.co.uk for everything astrology and michellenight.com for everything psychic and free tarot reading. See you there.